French Open quarterfinals, and there's been some big names already to depart along the way. Venus Williams, defending champions Svetlana Kuznetsova, Andy Roddick and Andy Murray are among them. But perhaps the biggest of all was Justine Ennen, who lost to Sam Stozer in the fourth round. That was a big upset, Phil. Yeah, it's a big upset. People wanted the Serena Justine quarterfinal. They thought these were the two to beat. Um, if you watched Justine early on in the competition, she struggled with her footwork. She couldn't close out games. And against someone like Sam Stozer, who's got the power to take Justine on, it you know, it's not that much of a shock, it's just the name is a big shock to go out. Well it is, and it's, it's the fourth round, we did expect yeah. her probably, if she was going to go out, it was going to be Serena who yeah. did it. So, you know, full credit to, to Sam, she was a semi-finalist here last year. She's got Serena Williams next. Yeah. Um, Serena's been travelling pretty well. Yeah. Um, Sam Stozer, she has got the game on clay to take it to Serena. Now Serena, she hasn't been playing that well, so this could be an upset here. She's had that injury all year in her leg. But she's starting to find a form, but is she really in championship form? Well, I, I would say yes, because apart from one dip in form when she was ill, yeah. and, and look, she, she dropped a set there against um, Anastasia Pavlyuchenkova, but bounced back once the uh, tablets kicked in, and I think she's been playing the kind of tennis that you know, is title winning form, and you look at who else is remaining in the draw, and... Possibly, I mean, possibly Stoze is the only one left to, well, and Yelena Yankovic. Yes, and they're all on one side of the draw, so it's definitely yeah. the toughest, tough, toughest side of the draw for the women. And yes, you've got Stoze and uh, Serena in a um, quarter-final, and then you've got uh, Yelena Yankovic in, in the other one, so, so that's tough. On the men's side of the draw, Andy Murray made it through to the fourth round. After a tough first round where he almost lost to Richard yeah. Gasquet, uh, he then found some form. But Thomas Burditch got rid of him pretty easily. Yeah, he got, he got this batch really. Just too many unforced errors, not enough winners from Murray. He's got the defensive game that should suit him on clay because he can chase it down, but he just doesn't have that weapon. He doesn't have that one single shot where you can rely on to, you know, put it down the line. It's maybe cross court, backhand, but that's not something you can rely on. That's just an opportune moment. And Andy Murray's really going to have to get find his game for the grass court season because Wimbledon is just around the corner. Yeah, that, that's right. But I guess when we get back to uh, Roland Garros, we've still got. Um, Rafael Nadal yep. and Roger Federer are there. Now, it's very hard to see a final that doesn't feature yep. them again. Um, Robin Soderling is probably the biggest challenger now to Roger Federer. I mean, Soderling's only been in once, I think. That was an exhibition. Yes, that's right, and earlier this so, year. You know, on, and there's 12 the losses. Yeah, beat him in the final last year comfortably. Maybe Soderling was in awe of the occasion, but... I mean, is it too much of a fairy, t fairy tale to say Soderling can, in consecutive years, defeat Nadal Yeah, I, I and think it's Federer. too much. The way Federer is playing at the moment, on, especially on clay, it's, he's doing quite well. And Rafa is just Rafa on clay, and not, no one's going to beat him. He struggled yesterday with a serve, but still, you, you can't see anyone beating him. No, and Leighton Hewitt uh, came out and played a, a good match for Hewitt, yeah. really, in the third round, and still, uh, Nadal was just that step, yeah, step above. Yeah, the, the power's back. He's not playing as his shots with as much topspin now so the ball's going deeper and that might suit Roger Federer in the final if they get there but I still can't see anyone beating that day on, on clay. Okay so there we have it, uh, that's a wrap of the action up to the uh, quarterfinals and we'll keep you up to date as the, the action unfolds.